Good evening. A woman charged with murdering her ex-husband is out of jail after a judge let her out without bond. Now, this judge did order supervision, but the victim's family says it is not nearly enough. News 13's Catherine Mazzone is live at district court with that story. Catherine. Dean Jess, the defendant's dad will be supervising her, according to the judge, but he lives more than a thousand miles away in Oregon. It has the victim's brother furious. All he did was love people. Dennis Fluitt is still struggling with his brother Don Fluitt's murder, but he says he was starting to heal. That is, until a judge released one of the accused killers without bond. Something like this happens and it, and it almost opens up all those wounds. According to the criminal complaint, police arrived at Fluitt's northwest Albuquerque home late December to find a bloody scene and Fluitt dead. Police arrested his ex-wife's new husband, Terry White, but said they didn't think his ex, Christine White, was involved. That all changed several months later when they arrested her too. Investigators allege Terry White told his MDC cellmate Christine urged him to kill Fluitt, saying, quote, you got to do this. You got to do this for your family. I find it hard to believe that she didn't know anything about this. And I'll say it right, right to the camera. But it's not so simple for the courts. Prosecutors tried to hold White without bond, but her attorneys argued, quote, she has strong, long-standing community ties and no significant criminal record. Plus, they say the new public safety assessment recommends she be released without bail. They claim prosecutors just wanted to keep White behind bars because she's charged with murder. Ultimately, the court agreed and ordered her father in Oregon supervise White via phone calls for Dennis. It's unacceptable. Christine has more rights as an accused murderer than my family has rights and my brother was brutally murdered. Well, we reached out to Christine White's attorney who says he'll also be checking in with her. He says the judge ruled that Christine be released because prosecutors didn't present enough evidence to keep her behind bars. Uh, we found that she has one previous conviction in 1997 for battery against a household member. Dean, back to you. All right, Catherine, thank you. Now, according to court documents, police suspect a custody battle might have been the motive. Currently, Christine White has custody of her and Fluitt's 11-year-old daughter.